Pro Gear manual treadmill, and uh, there you go. There's a bunch of numbers there. Pro Gear manual treadmill. I guess that's that's all it is. Yeah. Okay. So um, the, the the first two questions I always get asked is, are they hard to walk on and are they loud? So Okay, so that's how loud it is. Um, it's not too bad. Uh, once in a while, it it buzzes a little bit, but you know, uh, I guess that's just uh, the nature over the time. Oh yeah, I've had this for about two years now. <clears throat> uh, second question usually is, are they hard to walk on? So the setting it's on right now is at seven percent. And the there's two other settings which can be at set to eight percent or nine percent. There's the manual right there, so it can go to seven percent, eight percent, and nine percent. Okay, I would put this in the medium to hard range. Um, you know, you got your body weight going. You've got um, uh, there's there's no uh momentum generated by power so it's all manually done so yeah it's it's not very easy to walk on if you're looking for like just a normal kind of simple style walk you may want to look at an electric treadmill so manual is definitely uh, a little bit harder okay so let's check out the apparatus so this one here yeah you can see here it's got the two handles uh, it's got a like a digital display down here. It has two flywheels um, And then of course the tread and then of course it's set at an incline and then um, Back here uh, We'll talk about the adjustments later in the video up here This is your display and I'll just go through so scan, here I'm just gonna, there you go, scan, let me do that, there you go, scan, speed, distance, time, calories, and your odometer, and uh, there's the pro gear. So when you're on this to reset it, you just hold it down, and then it resets, then you can go. Uh, you have to make sure you're walking a little bit. Okay, so, um, my biggest issue so for after two years this is this is done very well uh, for me uh, the only issue I ever had with it that was kind of a reoccurring issue was adjusting this tread right here so you can see here it's in the middle I guess here hold on yeah right here you'll see right there and right there you can see it's in the center so to keep this in the center there's two adjustments right here and right here and you need an an allen key and you need to adjust it so it stays in the center that is not easy to do um, they talk about quarter turns and stuff like that and yeah for me it was um, still very difficult to do and then and yeah, it uh, stands upright, so it's pretty good. Size-wise, it's pretty cozy. Uh, you can see basically from the end there to here. I don't know, uh, to be safe, what, about 51 inches or so, 50 inches. And then from about here, it's about, oh, just, just under two feet. The construction is fine right here 
The only thing I would probably want is to put some sort of water bottle holder or something on it. Um, assembly is not, it, it's, you, you got it. There are some nuts and bolts that come with it and they have directions and stuff like that. Uh, I'd put that in the medium category. So right here you'll see there's a, like a small wheel and there's one on the other side. Uh, I had this in my basement and I had a white floor. It did mark it up so it left some black marks. So I'm not sure if that's just with this model but um, yeah if you're gonna roll it around be careful. This from Amazon and when it shipped to my house it was the box was really heavy and it was fairly large. Uh, I did it by myself, but if I were to go back in time, I would have somebody help me with it. So it, it this is not a light device. This is uh, pretty heavy. So, yeah. So the bottom line for me is would I buy this treadmill again? And the answer is I would not. Uh, reason being is I've ruptured both my Achilles tendons left and right over the last 10 years or so and sometimes when I'm walking I need an, a really easy day <laughs> so this is always medium to hard so I tend to skip the easy days uh, the solution would be I would purchase a um, electric treadmill maybe an under the desk style treadmill and I would just have that setting, that, that easy setting, um, so it would be less discouraging for me to walk. Anyway, that's my two cents on it. Uh, so that, that's the Pro Gear Manual Treadmill experience. Uh, yeah, thanks a lot. Bye.